Hello, it's David with Euro Motorcycles. Hey, I want to make a quick video today to address some inquiries we've gotten from new Euro owners on how to check their fluid levels. So today we're going to do that with the engine, the gearbox, and the final drive. Now that those of you that have been around Euro for a while, this may seem like uh, novice information, but keep in mind we got new people coming to Euro all the time, and for them this is this is new. So. We're not going to get into the debates over which oil is best, synthetic or standard. All I'll say is that all the bikes are shipped from the factory now with Motul motor oil, and we encourage you to use Motul whenever possible. So, if you want to follow along, we'll start with the um, with the engine oil. For the engine oil, the dipstick is right here underneath the alternator. No tools are required. Simply. Unscrew it. And with the engine cold, you're going to want to check the fluid level. The oil should be at the upper mark. And if it's not, you're going to have to add a little bit of 20W50. The motor takes 2.6 liters when, when empty. Now, if you need to wipe it and recheck it on this one you don't really have to dip you don't have to screw it back in just dip and check should be at the bottom of the first of the top mark screw it back in and there's a little o-ring that keeps it sealed just get it snug finger tight For the gearbox, you're going to need a 19 millimeter socket or a 19 millimeter wrench. You're going to break loose the dipstick and unscrew it. Now, on the gearboxes, they take 0.9 liters of 20W50. Once you have this unscrewed, if you have one of the newer bikes, you'll notice they have a little dipstick now. And this needs to be to the top mark when cold. If not, fill it a little bit until it is to that top mark. If you have to check it, wipe it and check it again, you got to thread it all the way in and thread it all the way out to get an accurate reading. Now, if you have an older model without the dipstick, this threaded hole right here, you look down there with a, a flashlight and you're going to want to see the fluid right up to the bottom of these threads right here. Now I will mention though, if you have this old style drain plug, this new one is available from your dealer and this will fit the older models. So you thread this back in and snug it back up once you've determined that it's at the proper level. Like that. Now for the final drive you're going to need again a 19 millimeter socket or a 19 millimeter wrench. Break the drain plug or the dipstick, rather, unscrew it and then you're going to check this on a cold final drive. And if you have to dip it again, you got to screw it all the way in. and then all the way back out. Now a two-wheel drive takes 115 milliliters of 75W90 and a one-wheel drive takes 90 milliliters of 75W90. And you're going to want this to be full up to the top mark again. Okay. Put that back in, screw it in, and then snug it up. And 
and that's it. Pretty simple. So if you have any other questions or comments, leave them below. And uh, if you'd like to see another topic covered, also leave a comment and let us know what that might be. Thanks, and we'll, we'll talk to you next time.